It's almost impossible to be unfamiliar with Kendall Jenner considering she's a member of what I would call one of the most iconic families today. She's a TV personality on the show most of us know, Keeping Up With The Kardashians, that she stars on with her family, mainly her sisters. Although Kendall's only 23 years old at the time of this recording, she's been famous for some years now, and whether you love them or hate them, this family doesn't seem to be slowing down. Aside from being a reality TV star, influencer, and businesswoman, she's also a big time model. In fact, Kendall was named the world's highest paid model from Forbes back in 2017. Being on reality TV since she was basically a kid, we've all been able to witness how far she's come. Kendall has certainly grown up over the years and looks totally different from the early days. Her younger sister Kylie seems to have gotten the majority of the attention in terms of how much she changed, like how she obviously had been getting lip fillers and denied it for the longest time. So Kendall has really been considered the natural one. But when you compare pictures from then and now, it makes you wonder if Kendall really is all that natural. Although Kendall seems to stay out of the tablet a bit more than her sisters, there's still a lot to be said about her. The girl is only in her early 20s and has already accomplished so much. But today we're going to be focusing more on her appearance and take a closer look at how that has changed since her early days in Hollywood. What's going on guys and girls, my name is Kara and this series we've titled Before and After. We're going to talk about how Kendall's changed over the years, including any work she's had done, her body and her style. I've done other celebrity transformation videos on stars like Bella Hadid and Ariana Grande and we'll have links to those at the end of this video. If there's anyone else you want me to document, let me know in the comments down below. Now let's get into this video. Let's start with Kendall's face. The star has never admitted to getting work done, but there's definitely been speculation. Kendall addressed any plastic surgery rumors back in 2017, stating it's all so exhausting. As a model, why would I have my face reconstructed? It doesn't even make sense. It's crazy because sometimes I feel like people just want me to lose. This could very well be the truth. I mean, she was only 13 when she made her debut on TV, so of course a lot of changes could have been simply from growing up and maturing. However, in some photos, it looks like there might have been some less than natural changes to her features. Firstly, looking at Kendall's nose, there's a chance she could have gotten a rhinoplasty. Comparing photos, her nose seems to have gotten thinner and sleeker than it used to be. Of course, creating the image of a sleeker nose could always be the work of great makeup and contouring, but it's hard to tell. Although people's faces tend to change as they grow up, the shape of the nose is something that generally stays the same. Kendall's nose used to look wider when she was a kid, and now it looks pretty much perfect. Back in 2016, fans were curious if Kendall had any work done in her forehead eye area, because her eyebrows seemed to look higher up on her face than before. If she did get something done here, it was likely a brow lift. I think this procedure is something that isn't super noticeable or easy to pinpoint until you start looking at pictures side by side from before and after. It can also create a more cat-eyed look. It's also been speculated that Kendall has gotten lip fillers. I think this one may be true considering her lips were super Super thin in her teen days, and now they're fuller. Although these still look natural when you look at her top lip, especially in photos, the difference is there. Another spot that Kendall has been accused of getting fillers is in the cheeks. This I'm not 100% sure about, but in some pics her cheeks definitely look smoother and more raised, giving off the impression that she did. It's also been said that Kendall may have gotten fillers in her chin as well as anti-wrinkle injections. However, I can't really tell much of a difference in her chin and considering she's still so young, I don't think she would need Botox unless it was preventative. I'm not really sure what Kendall has or hasn't gotten work done for, but either way she looks gorgeous so who really cares, right? Moving on to Kendall's body. The girl has a great figure and I think most people would agree. I'm also pretty certain there's nothing fake here. Standing at 5'10", Kendall is naturally tall and slim, so it's no surprise she's a model. I mean, how hot does she look walking the Victoria's Secret runway? With Kendall's body shape, everything looks real and I see no signs of plastic surgery like a boob job or anything. But even though she has had a great body through the years, she still has to put in work to keep it toned. In order to keep her body so fit, Kendall has a personal trainer, Gunnar Peterson, who makes a workout schedule to suit her needs. Her trainer has said that her workouts are intense though. Apparently she does a lot of ab workouts, weight training and cardio, and her preferred cardio includes jogs and kickboxing classes. Kendall also has said she has a key at home workout that only takes 11 minutes. You can find her special workout online, but it basically has 13 different moves, which include a lot of plank variations, crunches and donkey kicks. Kendall's diet doesn't sound too restricting and she says she still enjoys foods like In-N-Out Burger, Pizza and Pasta. 
She also claims that two of her favorite cheat foods are cupcakes and Twix chocolate bars. But before any fashion week, Kendall does get stricter with her diet, which will then include a lot of lean protein, brown rice, and veggies. In general, she just claims to balance the healthy stuff with the not so healthy and keeps everything in moderation. So I guess if you want a body like Kendall, it sounds like it's a combination of naturally good metabolism, a balanced diet, and intense workouts. Looking at Kendall's style, it's pretty easy to see how much it's evolved over the years. Being introduced to Hollywood from such a young age, she was getting dolled up for the red carpet as a preteen. In terms of her hair and look in general, it hasn't seemed to change much as she's gotten older. Kendall has always rocked her dark brown hair for the most part, and all she's really done is switch between longer and shorter hairstyles, it seems. Her fashion sense keeps getting better over the years, and she's had a ton of great outfits. While walking the red carpet, she's pulled off a ton of different outfits, some simple, some glam, and some shocking. Kendall's street style is also suitable for a supermodel, as she's always trendy. Somehow she always looks super cool, even if she goes for something more casual. By looking at Kendall's transformation over the years a little closer, you can see how the star has changed. Although her changes may not have been as drastic as some of her sisters, there are still some things that may leave you wondering if she's all natural or not. In my opinion, she looks gorgeous regardless. Either way, Kendall and her superstar family don't seem to be going anywhere, and her modeling and TV career will likely only keep growing. She's still young, so I definitely wonder what the future will hold. All right, guys and girls, that wraps up this video here on Before and After. If you want to talk more about Kendall's transformation, you can hit me up on Instagram. Let me know who else you would like me to make a before and after video on, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!